Mr. Vries here uh, bringing you a tutorial video. Um, this is part of uh, Group B of um, the Trinity College requirements um, and it's number nine, uh, the Space March. It's quite a long little, um, uh, a long little exercise and uh, there are some te technical difficulties um, which you want, might want to practice a little bit slower than I was playing it which is actually just the recommended speed. Um, Conmoto with motion um, goes at about 112. Uh, we don't go over the break so um, that's good. Um, dynamics wise um, you do want to start at a healthy forte. It only goes down to a mezzo piano, so um, don't be too worried. Uh, I, just make sure that you have um, enough breath um, in the last four bars to reach a fortissimo. Breathing wise, in this piece, um, I would go every four bars. Um, it's uh, sort of quite natural, really, to, to go the four bars. Um, that's where the phrasing is. Um, so you want a really, really solid forte at the beginning. So you want a really, really solid sound between the F and the C. Make sure that you're lifting all the fingers up and putting them down um, at uh, the same time so it's coordinated because you don't want you don't you don't want that sort of um, notes you don't want the extra notes in there. In this passage might want to play that um, a little bit slower till you get the hang of it and it's actually just a straight C major scale going from the G to the C um, but uh, you don't learn uh, C major um, in grade one so so the first eight bars I would breathe at the end of the fourth and then the eighth <laughs> bars really take advantage of the lower end of the clarinet which we call the shalomo um, just a really really rich sound um, and again coordinate between the C and the E C and the A Um, we work on that in the next few bars. So this is bar nine. We're down to a mezzo piano. Make sure that you coordinate between the F and the D. And also the F and the A. Um, if you watched my previous videos, you would know just to roll up to the A. to breathe um, uh, at the end of a crescendo but it doesn't so I don't think it really matters here as long as you don't cut off the note before it too much
play it um, all the way through once again and that'll be the end of the lesson. <laughs> number nine the space march which is from the trinity college mosaics clarinet uh, book one uh, this is a group b uh, requirement for the grade one trinity college clarinet syllabus so i hope that uh, you've enjoyed this video and uh, got something from it uh, please don't hesitate to contact me in any form um, if you have suggestions uh, or questions um, about this or any other aspect of clarinet playing. So, thanks for listening. Bye for now.